Yo, nigga, I'm dead. I'm gonna stroke my dick in your face, bitch ass nigga. Yo, nigga, I'm dead. I'm gonna stroke my dick in your face, bitch ass nigga. Yeah, yo, send that shit again. Post something? Yeah. But I never posted, so I thought you seen that shit. Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I don't know. I was going to post it our story. Oh, oh, okay. So he's supposed to look like he's getting fucked. Yeah, he's getting puff shots. Puff, <laughs> puff shots? Mm -hmm. Anyways. Uh, hello. Uh, what's up? We in my garage. Tell you shit. We're, where were we last time? Um, The car. We were with uh, a man named Eric Solis. We're always in the car, aren't we? How many car episodes do we have? At least 10 to 15. We have more now. Well, like... 15 minimum. Video recording, like, car ones. Obviously, we have, like... like eight. Eight That's of them? That's a good number, yeah. Like, you think eight out of, like, what? When did we start recording video? Like, episode 30, right? Something like that. It was something like that. Okay, so we have, like, yeah, we have, like, 10 episodes of us um showing our cocks on camera. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In the car. Yeah, in cars. Okay, but this is the first one in the garage. Yeah, it's the first one in the garage. It's the first one in the garage. It's always first. Um, Because we have one of you in the car by yourself. And oh, yeah. one with me and uh, Ant-Man in the car. I forgot about them bitches. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, we, I'd be recording episodes. I'd be like, I said that? Like, Taisha, I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know. You know what? what's crazy? You know how, like, I have, like, poor memory? Mm-hmm. Type shit, my, my cousin said I was, that's like a result because I'm malnourished. I like, thought, I thought like dementia or something else passed that. I'm not sure, I'm not a doctor. I don't even know anyone with dementia, but like shit. But like, I'm like, damn, maybe I should start. Oh yeah, where's more. your cousin? Uh, I don't know, he won't, he's on my aunt. Oh, okay. No, nah, he, he, he pulled up and the first thing he told me was, he accused me, he's like, Oh, you're bulim bulimic now, type yeah. shit. Like, like bro, every bulimic now, uh, bro. No, bro, no, bro. Listen, bro. I fought so hard for this eating disorder, bro. I'm not just gonna give up. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Type shit, type shit. Bro. Nah, I get you. You know, like even eating clean or being on a diet is considered a health disorder. Yeah, really? Yeah, cause like you, like like let's say like there's chocolate in front of me. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to lose weight. You know, I'm trying to get like Sam Sulik type shit. And if I'm like, if I say no to a chocolate, I'm like really fighting the urge, you know, that's like not right. Or that's not supposed to be normal. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. I'm not I, competing. Like I'm not, you know. You know what's great? I saw you know, what you just talked about. I, I saw like a no fat video, like a, like a no fat video that had like so, so, something like that. But like the dude was against no fat. Like he was like. Oh, I see a lot of videos. Like, 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 like type shit like no fat is bullshit type like videos. You feel me? Like yeah, what you think about no fat? No fat. Five five weeks strong, five weeks. I'm two shit. days no strong. Booner, no booner heads. What's up? What, what, why'd you why'd you break? When you feel me? Why'd you break? Five. I couldn't go to sleep one night. I had too much coffee. Re really? So you need mm -hmm. to like on some. On it's some like it's like almost like getting the exercise out. So instead of like lifting weights, I just gotta bust a quick one out. That's it. Tell you shit. Mm -hmm. That's all I got. Like that. Do. That gives you like the same like stimulus or i don't know like the same dopamine rush or uh, say a similar rush to lifting i don't know i think i heard like if you if you fuck it's like you burn uh -huh. like a decent amount of calories while fucking i'm not fucking i'm just using my hand but you think so you, we'll you, like we'll you're like round it down crazy? we'll round it down to like about half of that you so you're not you're going that crazy that no, you're i'm not burning going that the, crazy say so i was about to say like you going like you ever seen that clip of EDP where he's like, oh, if you're not sweating, like, you're not jerking off correctly. Like, you sweating, like, on some yeah, EDP Yeah, EDP's shit. a pedophile now. Like, mm. like, who? EDP's a pedophile. I know a pedophile. I know one, too. He's camping right now. <laughs> They're both camping. Nah, was fucked. How's your week, though? Um, I, I just got fat neons hitting on me at work. Yeah? Yeah, it's two fat chicks, but I don't like them. Mm -hmm. You know, two fives don't equal a ten, and they're not even fives; they're like threes on a good day. Okay, but you gotta. If you saw them, you would you would also think the same. Would, I swear, uh, uh, you it's not you a don't know, thing. No, 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 you no. You don't no. know my. I get it. No, I get, I get it. You don't know my gusto. Okay, okay, hold on. Let's put it like this. You ever see my cousin, the fat one with glasses? I haven't seen her in like. She looks the same. Years. Looks she looks bigger actually. Oh really? Yeah. Okay. So like, like that because they look like like sometimes uh -huh. I'm like, yo, is that my cousin or is because like they look at me. Yeah. My cousin looks at me. The other girl looks at me. Wait, your so cousin's like, looking? Well, cause like That's she's like crazy. laughing. 
yo, what the fuck? Like, in that way, bro? I just said she's looking at me. I didn't say anything. Well, but but you said, like, the other two were looking at you, you feel me? So but they all look at me. Well, but that makes sense. Like, if you're my friend, I'm gonna look at you. Yeah, but, like, you're, like, group Bro, this isn't the 1800s, in, like, bro. We're not fucking her okay. cousins. <laughs> okay. Because a wise man once said, if this was the 1900s, I could fuck my cousin right now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Who was that wise man? Exactly. That's me. That's me. You know, I stand by that. You feel me? If it was the 1900s, I wouldn't be here. I'd be... Nah, you compared yeah. it to slavery too. <laughs> How did I compare that to slavery? <laughs> You're like, well, you see, slavery it was like oh. socially acceptable. So doing your cousin back in the day was also socially acceptable. Oh, well, that wasn't me comparing it. I feel like it was just me making like an analogy or some shit. Yeah, what a bad analogy talking about slavery. <laughs> but you bring it back? No, I wouldn't bring right, slavery right. back. Well, good to know. No, no, wait, hold up. Not for like black folks. Like, I feel like. I feel like very violent criminals. We should like they they should be like, it's like, like slaves, like like slaves, yeah, or like or like pedophiles, like convicted sex offenders and shit. Should be like we should like have them be slaves and shit. Like I don't nah, know, like day laborers and shit. Pedophiles, in my opinion, is just a rope behind the neck in front of the town hall. Well, like you know, there's some people against that, right? Which is you got your arguments for that, but like okay, instead of like killing them, right? Because people. A lot, a lot of people don't want to kill him either. So it's like, okay, we just make you fucking indentured you know, slaves. Is that what it's like called? Indentured slaves or whatever. We just make you like fucking build fucking buildings or some shit. You know what I mean? Also, whatever the Egyptians did to the fucking Jews or whatever, that shit. Mm-hmm. Shout because out my remember, the Jews killed Christ. Who said that? I think you did too. I said that. Yeah, I swear to God, you said that. You told I, me. I only, I think I only said that because you said something like that before. Like off camera, obviously. I didn't know that. No, I swear I didn't even know that. You said I'm not. Said I'm not like huge said, into the Bible. You, no, you said something. Similar. I said that I told you, it to you, my you. manager, and he didn't even understand the concept. He was like some short guy, some short Mexican guy, uh-huh. whose like teeth are facing each other. Yeah. And I told him one day, I was like, "Yo, what's up?" And I was like, "Yo, did you know like the Jews killed Christ?" It just like his mind blew up. He didn't know how to comprehend that. He just kind of just, and he's like, "Oh." Yeah, <laughs> fucking frozen time. Well, hey man, I'm just saying like you brought something like that up, and it just stayed in my head, and I and I said that. But you're the originator of that, like whatever the fuck that was that like thought. I told it to my other coworker, and he's like, "Yeah, a lot of people don't know that shit." <laughs> I was like, "Okay, tell you shit, tell you shit." Mm-hmm. But yeah, no, the love of your life's not gone. She, she's, she, she's off, bro. She, yeah, she's gone. She left. She left me for a Navajo, for no. an Indian Navajo. Oh, bro. Come on, bro. You never, you never tapped that? You never tapped that? You didn't hit that yet? You didn't hit that? You didn't God. hit that? God. Had pressure. I have the same, I had the same reaction to, like, he never hit. It's crazy. Like, fuck her boyfriend, bro. Nah, if a... She was, she was too, um, what's the word? She just, she just wouldn't cheat on her man, you feel me? How you know that? How you, how you know that? Oh, you never, I you talked never, to her. You never, like, that, Come like, here, brought buddy. it up to her, be like, yo... Like let's do you know what I mean? If if a if a chick gonna cheat, he's texting her right now. Nah, yeah. Nah, he's texting, texting right her right now. I am texting her. Right now I'm just saying if like a chick gonna cheat, she gonna cheat. You feel me? So like, might as well. Wait, now I'm confused. Huh? Would you tap? Because you say like, you say I have like. Because you're right. No, no, you're actually 100 percent right. I agree with this. Uh huh. I have like a higher threshold of what I want my woman to look like, and you're yeah. just lower. That's what. We agree on that, right? Yeah. So then, would you pipe anonymous mask? Nah. See that? Comp- but is it because she's white? Like, it what is she, it like, might have. Yeah, it might have. Because she's white. Oh, okay, okay. that makes more sense. She's white. Might yeah. have to do it. Maybe if she was like a little Morindita. bit, a little bit more. You feel me? If she is, where is she from? Uh, that country, right? Yeah. So let's say it goes a little bit more east. You know, she was more from the east end. Maybe I would. But since she's more to the West End, I'm like, nah, I'm good off of that. And again, again, I have to, I, put, I have to put emphasis on this. I don't hate white women. I just don't like y'all in a romantic sense. You feel me? Or in a sexual mm-hmm. sense, I just don't prefer y'all over your other female counterparts. You feel me? But I don't hate white women. You feel me? Shout out. I can't shout them out. I'm not gonna. Lie. Are we gonna shout out? I was gonna shout out. Shout white out white women. women I, shout out woman. I hate you guys. No, I don't hate them. I don't hate them. It's just like I just like in a dating sense or like in a, 
in a sexual sense, I just like wouldn't like prefer one over like any any other type of race. You know what I mean? That's just me personally, but I know you're a milkman. You love white woman. You love. You said a milkman. You a milkman. That milk was for you know girls who have big knockers. Nah, but you like you know consuming milk. bunnies. You like that. You, you love like the milk. You bunnies. love the milk. You're the milkman. You feel me? Type shit. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's what you is, man. And what what would that make me? What would that okay, if you're the milkman, what am I? Chocolate milk lover? I don't know. <laughs> Chad no, cause oh, I guess it was chocolate milk would be like a biracial chick, right? Choco milk, I don't like know. a like logic sister would be who the hell are well, you? What is E D you say? <laughs> a banana choqueada? Uh, what? A banana he says some shit. Bro, you're banana choqueada. I don't even know what you're talking about. So say what you just said. What? A sentence. I said, what did I say? Oh, it'd be like logic sister. You feel like mm-hmm. you know, you know what I mean. What like, happened to her? That's that's and that's what I said. I, I think that's what you heard. I said, who the hell raped your sister? You feel me? That's what I said. I think that's what you heard, bro. So I that mean, type shit. Yo, if a chop sway gets uh invitation to an all white party, we going? I feel like I feel like I'm gonna get like. You ever you ever heard of that story of that black chick who went to like an all white sleepover and like they killed her type shit? You ever, you That's ever crazy. That? You ever, yeah, bro, they killed. You trying to get reparations? Nah, no. I mean, I'm not black, right? I can't I can't claim no reparations for that. But like, I feel like some shit like that will happen to us. You know what I mean? Like they'll see us as like the outsiders. No, no, they'll try and do some fuck shit to us. I know that for sure. I don't tr- I don't trust white people hundred percent like that. You feel me? No, I was talking about a different white out party because you know chops when we take off right, like we're gonna be big. We're gonna be like big names. White out party is that one guy who invites like Kim K, Aiden Ross. Oh, oh yeah, and there's all supposed to be like you know. Oh, bro, I th- I just thought you meant like a it's fully like white if chops was invited to a Diddy party. Oh, a Diddy but it's party? not a Diddy party. That's what it is, you know. So you want to go to the Diddy party? No, I'm saying if we get invited, are we going? To the Diddy party. Not the Diddy party. We're not headed to the Diddy party. Ain't no party like the Diddy party. Yeah? Mm-hmm. So wait, what are you asking me? Would you go? To the Diddy party. Yeah. <laughs> you coming to the Diddy party? You coming at no, the Diddy I'm party? No, I'm not going to the Diddy party. I'm not coming in the Diddy party. Because that's gay. No. You feel me? Like no homo. Like, that's gay as fuck. Mm-hmm. I think Diddy, by the time Chopsley blows up, he's going to allegedly hang himself in GTA 5 role play. <laughs> Where the fuck is he? Is in, he jail. in jail. He's in jail? There's a mugshot. I use the same mugshot on shorts. I like Anthony and then Diddy. Dog, I thought he was still on the run. I didn't know where the fuck the dude was. Yeah. I ain't been ki- I don't keep up with Diddy. I'm not, a- I'm not too deep into that. You know what I, mean? I don't uh, keep updates on like Diddy's whereabouts or his, or his situation currently. But hey, good thing he's in jail, right? Yeah, he did like a, he used that classic. He did a textbook backhanded slap on a woman, and I think that that's what sent allegedly. him to jail. Alleg- allegedly, that's what sent him to jail, and then you're trying to drop all the charges of him being a, you know, everything. Damn, for real? Hmm. How you know that? I don't know. I just seen you know, it on TikTok. I feel like you be reading into this shit. You you really interested in, invested in Diddy? You got something to say? No, nah, I didn't even know who Diddy was till like they started talking about him. You, <laughs> like I know they mentioned him in songs and shit, but like I didn't know that. Like I didn't, I, I don't know. Wake yeah. up in the morning, damn, it's, like, it's, it's, it's Diddy. It's crazy. Right after bro got exposed for being a homosexual, you started talking about him like crazy. You got some sort of special he's homosexual in him? too. Uh yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, he takes butts. Yeah. That, okay, yeah. Well, there you go. I mean, and, he and just got so, arrested. That's so, why. So after after you hear about Diddy taking butts, you you now you know all up on Diddy meat. No pause, no pause. Yeah, I'm gonna do you like they did Diddy. So watch out. What? Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna do you like they did Diddy. I'm gonna do you're gonna do me like they did Diddy. Mm-hmm. So, so what does that mean? Because Diddy was taking butts. He wasn't really. Yeah, but he definitely got his butt taken. By who? Who took his butt? Are you know. are you would know. I, tra- Anthony I, would probably, you know. I think Anthony could probably answer this. He'd probably tell you like Pac. Pac did that shit. Pac took Diddy's butt. Mm, allegedly. No, no. You get thrown allegedly in. Uh, Pac's dead, bro. Fuck that, mm, yeah, bro. Yeah, 100% happened. <laughs> I guess it's <laughs> six feet under, bro. Fuck it. Fuck out of Yeah, you're six feet under. That shit happened, for sure. Pac. Talk about Pac. 
I remember um, Anthony back in the day, he did a, an ice bucket challenge. You ever seen that shit? No. That when, shit's mad funny. When did he do ice bucket challenge? What the fuck? I think he took it down or he had it on Snapchat. But he was in his bathroom, you know, he did the ice, fucking threw out the water on his head. And you know how they do like call outs? Mm-hmm. I don't know who Anthony was calling out. He like called out all his buddies. He was like, yo, shout out Aula, shout out Dan. And shout out to that Indian Navajo girl I met last night. That's who he shouted out at the... What's that shit called? Ice yeah. Bucket Challenge. What was this? I don't know, but this is real. Like, I'm not even playing. Like, this I is, feel a, like that. I feel like this is no bullshit. You, you could proof? ask him. We could call you him. You have any proof? We could call him. He did the Ice Bucket Challenge. I swear. I don't know what I'm... Th- yeah, I don't know if he posted it, but he posted it on some type of social media. I remember that. Yeah, Anthony did the Ice Bucket Challenge. <laughs> feel old yet? <laughs> <laughs> The fuck out of here. No way that's real. It or like at least real. like it's like on video. Should be on video. Junior probably had it in there recording. How long is it? This, I'm asking you, how long ago was this? I don't know. When did the ice bucket challenge come out? Damn, I don't even know. Again, I'm malnourished. I have an eating disorder, so my, my brain's fucked. So I, I'm relying on you really for dates and shit. I don't know. That means Anthony's one old ass motherfucker. Not for sure. That makes Anthony a fucking grandpa. Holy shit. For sure, for sure. Anthony grew up playing the Atari. No, not even. What's older than the Atari? What came first? Like checkers. <laughs> Chess. <laughs> Anthony grew up playing Chinese checkers. Anthony grew up like, playing outside with sticks, you know? Instead of watching like TikTok. You, you already know that Anthony was Chinese? Mm. Yeah, mm. yeah. He's str- straight from China. He- He's Filipino? <laughs> <laughs> nah, but I think, I think he's Chinese He's straight from the Ming Dynasty You ain't know that? From the Ming Dynasty? From the Ming Dynasty Supposedly he's like a third generation prince You ain't know that? Anthony's a prince? Yeah, from the Ming Dynasty You ain't know that? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's why That's why that's, that's why, like, that's why when Anthony takes photos he like His eyes be a little squinted and shit Because he's Chinese, bro But he's, he told me he for, he, It's been so long He forgot Chinese Like I, I think Anthony... Like, unofficially, is the oldest person alive. Cause the oldest you know, Chinese person alive, thanks to you now. Now that I know that. Yeah, old. Yeah, the oldest person alive and the oldest Chinese person alive type shit. So, I've just been, been, on, been around for a minute. I'm not gonna lie. Anthony. <laughs> yeah, talking about Anthony, like, I always see him, like, swiping right and left on twin, Tinder. Like, that's all he does, right? Yeah. Like, when, you, when Anthony's on his phone, what is he doing? Swiping left and right, yeah. Exactly. That's why I have to stop doing Tinder because there's too many sweats in that shit. I can't compete with motherfuckers like Anthony. Yeah, yeah you can. You're third, to would you say third, third dynasty? Fucking Anthony Mejia, prince. Third generation. Third generation. Dynasty, prince Anthony Mejia. I guess so. That's like that's one hell of a comp. But listen, you're child. Prince play. to five nine. <laughs> <laughs> but listen, like. Like, but you're chop sway. I feel like that's that's perfect comp for you. You feel me, Chinese? Royalty? If I'm chop sway, where's the timeline where I marry Clara? Soon, soon. soon. Clara, if you're watching this, mm-hmm. my boy right here wants wants to procreate. Yeah, yeah, spit it out. Yeah, yeah. You want you want to have children with Clara? Uh, I let Clara have like two or three of my children, cause I gotta have multiple baby mamas. So so, who are your other baby moments then? Like, who you got planned? Mm. That's a hard one. That's a hard one, but there's a lot. Um, I got to spin the block on Antonella. Hopefully, her tubes ain't tied, because I'm trying to hit that back. <laughs> All right. Um, who else? Fuck, I can't think at the top of my head. Right now, but there's a few. There's a few out there. Mm-hmm. Just know it's it's more than five. More than ten. More than five. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm gonna build my own dynasty on some Anthony. Type shit. Chopsway is gonna have like. Combine me and you, right? Mm-hmm. Like, Chopsway total. How many kids do you think we have? In, like, a thousand? Like, I, I think we could populate like a like a entire small town. You feel me? Like, small towns, what? Like, population a thousand, right? No, well. Yeah, no. Small town, population a thousand. I feel like. Both of us just off of our offspring alone, a thousand kids. You feel you me? Mean like grandkids come on to no, no, that's kids? just that's just the first generation kids? kids, bro. I swear to god, I'm gonna be active once you, I start. Once I start, like 500 women when, minimum. Once I start producing, I won't reproducing, I won't stop. You feel me? Like, type, shit, I'm gonna be a beast. 
you can't have to bang like 500 women and like expect them to have two kids at least. Yes. That's exactly what's going to happen. And we're going to afford that off that Chopsway money. For sure, for mm-hmm. sure. Chopsway is going to rule all of North Dakota type shit. North Dakota? No, I want to I wanna rule like North and South Carolina. Shit, I want to rule that like in the next two weeks, you feel me? Shit. There's some un, un, uh, undiscovered business I got to do out there. Undisclosed business I got to do out there. So I'm going to run North and South Carolina. You got North Dakota though? You part of the mafia? Mm hmm. <laughs> the fuck? What, what do you mean, type of undisclosed business? What the fuck? I got some mean? undisclosed business I gotta go run That's some real sketchy shit. Yo, you a crypto mm-hmm. or some shit? Yeah, I'm part of the five families of the mob. Well, that's a fucking lie, because you're a spick. No, yeah, I actually, I'm not, I would never claim that. I'm like, you're a fucking spick, though, yo. That, I know that's a lie, but I mean, shit. Oh, wait, you're a spick, right? So, what, you a cartel or something? Yeah, I knew you were going to say cartel. You cartel or something? You MS-13? No, I'm part of the... um, What are they called? Al-Qaeda? So, I come here on rugs and shit. But you're not Muslim. Oh, wait, no. You kind of... You are... You don't don't eat pork. No, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't eat pork. You qualify... You qualify... We we get called Muslims all the time. You qualify as a Muslim because you you don't eat pork. You feel me? So, Mm -hmm. I mean, shit. I guess so. Inshallah. You know what's crazy? I saw... I saw the a video of Saddam Hussein getting hanged, and I'm like, not gonna lie. I can't wait till the day we do that to Angelo. Oh, yeah, type shit. And we're gonna throw his body at, like, Point Nemo, so, like, nobody will ever find him. Yeah? yeah I was thinking, thinking we're just, that. like, burning him, but, like, we can do that, too. Burn him, then fucking spread his ashes over there. Yeah. Middle like, of the ocean. But, like, we burn him, right? And, like, what do we... <sighs> we roll him up. Somebody... Ha- we're not smoking his ashes, right? Because... Shit probably what, got like We two. got like Eric and Anthony To like roll him up In a spliff Okay Anthony and Eric Will roll him up And then somebody else Has got to smoke him Somebody else Has got to smoke him to Everybody's him. Everybody who's gonna smoke him Has to smoke him Equal parts Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, Like Like exactly Like the same puff And everything But who's gonna smoke him Like we still don't have Like a contender To smoke Angelo How many blunts Are we getting out of Angelo He's one hefty boy now So probably like three Three blunts, three what fat blunts. No, wait, no, no, wait. An a- okay, so like, uh, average. Okay, okay. So how many? Like, okay. Let's say you have a vase about this big, right? To put Angelo's ashes. You got in. Angelo for a whole month. Okay, <laughs> okay, right. So you have a vase that's like this big, right? Look, mm-hmm. look. You see my hands, right? I'm not. This is not ass. This is a. This is a vase, right? Okay. So how much of the vase do you think is gonna fill with Angelo's ashes? Like what percentage? And then that's how we estimate how many blunts we can roll up of Angelo. You get like 40 blunts out of Angelo. Yeah, 40 blunts, right? So who are we passing these 40 blunts to? I don't know. We always talk about giving out to charity, so we're just going to... So we're going to give Angelo blunts to homeless? We're going to give 40 blunts. Yeah, 40 blunts to homeless guys. Okay. You know how they're like, I want money for weed? Yeah. We just give them the weed. But it's Angelo. Shit, you know what? You're right. We're better off lacing weed with Fent yeah. and giving it to homeless people than handing out Angela's pack. We should just, like, go to, like, like you know those, um, like, North Sentinelese tribes. Like, un, like uncontacted, untouched. like, untouched tribes and just, like, give them some Angelo type shit. Mm, or, no, never mind. Oh, okay, no, I got a better one. Or, because Chops is going to be so big, right? Mm-hmm. Before we get rid of him... Like, you know, he's still alive. Mm-hmm. You ever watch Willy Wonka where, like, you know, like, you get a chocolate bar and if you get, like, the golden ticket, you get to go to Willy Wonka's factory. Yeah. So if you get the golden ticket, you get to Angelo, you get to watch Angelo perish in real time. <laughs> <laughs> and you can keep his dog. No, but, uh, well. No, nah, we got to send Angelo, well, Angelo's dog with him. <laughs> that dog's seen too much. That, that dog's seen, been through too much. Satan's getting two people at once. Angel and his dog. <laughs> two people. I mean, two, um, two, two creatures, I guess. Two, he's getting two souls at mm-hmm. once. If you can even call what Angel has a soul. Exactly. So, Lucifer, if you're watching this, come and pick up your man's Angel. <laughs> if you're watching this, Lucifer. Tell you shit, tell you shit. Yeah, come get your man's, bro, because we, we don't want him here no more. You feel me? So, mm. For sure. For sure. Come get bro. What type shit? You say you had a hole in your pants? Yeah, you want to see it? Yeah, let me see. 
It's somewhere here. I don't know where it's at. I just know it's here. And this time I'm really meat watching. I know I said I wasn't meat watching. I'm meat watching this time. I'm not gonna lie. You meat watching? I'm meat watching heavy. Take shit. shit. I no gotta gay go, shit. I got, I got a hole over here. I can't fit my finger through it. Yeah. Oh, but you probably figured you're dingling. No, I can't. You're dingling through it? Yeah. Well, on soft, you can. If really, you try really hard. Because cause when you're soft, right, you're just like kind of flexible. You feel like, not oh, flexible, but like hurt. squishy. But you can do it. You feel me? Like, like shit, if, if a hole not too small, like, you know, let me see. Let me see the hole, right? I, I, I can't feel it. No, you, like you can really squish it and put get it through there. Dude, you can disgusting. do that. You can do that, though. You can do that for sure. It's like skinning a sausage. Oh, oh my God. It's you know, like stripping <laughs> copper out of its wires. <laughs> you know, you know what trans, like, you know how transgenders, right? They get, like, their operation, like, so, like, a trans woman, mm-hmm. right? Like, they cut her penis off and they give her a vagina. Should we just do that to Angel instead of killing him? Nah, because then they put, they put Angel to use. Angel would have a use in this world. Nah, because, like, it's still Angelo, <laughs> but he got a pussy, you feel me? It's like who's gonna? But like somebody's gonna want to do it to him because he has a panocha. <laughs> but so th- that's but not, he's still nah. Angelo though. No titties, no not like literally like, beard, like like think about There's Angelo. People who bro. look like Long that out hair. in the world. Long hair, no chest though. Looks exactly same, but he got. Like I feel like that's a, like. Nah, cause nope. he, he doesn't have a use in this world right now. But if he has a pussy, <laughs> it's gonna be a use for Angelo. <laughs> I guess so. Some homeless is probably gonna fuck him, right? Like, yeah, hearing that he shit. has a pussy type shit. Yeah, because, like... Yeah, 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 type shit. Yeah. He can find, like, some bisexual rapper that's gonna want to do it to him. Mm, that sounds fucking gross. Yo, send him to fucking uh, Frank Ocean. Yeah, Frank Ocean, Frank, Frank Ocean. Ocean will probably f- fuck Angela with a pussy. Damn, Angela, you came back with Chanel. Where'd you get that from? Frank Ocean. <laughs> type yeah. shit. No, nah, bro, yeah. Bloody bro got fucking his guts rearranged by Tyler Creator. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you shit, but yeah. Um, yeah, so Zion, when Chopstick takes off, you can hit up Angelo. You can rizz him up. He's got a pussy now. <laughs> Yo, oh my fat God. pussy. Oh, don't say it like that, bro. That sounds disgusting. You said we were gonna give him a pussy to begin with. Yeah, but you but you just said, said it's no tits, fat. nothing. Yeah, but you said it's gonna be fat. That that <laughs> sounds disgusting. That like okay, it's already disgusting what we're discussing, but you saying that it's that it's fat, it's nasty. What are you gonna say? It's hella wet too, huh? Yeah, it's fat and wet. Yeah, what do you want me to say next? Don't knock it till you try it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck no. You, okay. That's fucking hilarious. Who? Okay, so who's like the most like you know how Anthony has like his uh, his philosophy of like pussy's pussy, right? Who's the most pussy is pussy person you know? Anthony. No, cause no, there's there's gotta be more pussy. Like people. out in the world, um, like just people you know. Some Ecuadorian kids probably I went to school with. Yeah. Yeah. You think they're the, you think they're more on that pussy is pussy shit? Like they're all off the deep end on that shit. Or I don't know, like people who like fuck homeless people. Who who fucks? I don't fucking people? know, but like I'm guessing somebody out there does. No, but I'm like, saying you know, like, like money, someone, like not even prostitutes, like like you know, like someone you per like I, okay, so someone out of all the people you personally know, Anthony's the most like pussy's pussy person that you know. Yeah, because then everybody else is like it's family, like uh, Estuardo. What do you mean it's family? Like I like Anthony, like Estuardo, he's on that timing. Oh, uh, depression. He wants to go to prison. You're trying to raise up a 13 year old one day. Oh, really? You weren't there? No. Nah. Oh my God, well, that's well, even crazier. Well, what? Tell, so there's a 13 year old. He's 18, and he'll he'll admit that he likes kids, right? It's <laughs> fucked. You've heard him admit it. You know, he's, he's he admits it in idea. the car. Like you get him to say it. But when did this happen? It was at some birthday party, and um, there's like a 13 year old, and he looks at her and he's like, "Yo, like I'm gonna go spit riz." I look at her, she turns around, and I'm like, yo, like, she looks young. Mm-hmm. And Eric's there, and Anthony's there. And they agree with me. They're like, yo, like, she looks kind of young. And he's like, so, bro? No importa. <laughs> it doesn't matter. And I was like, oh, wow, okay. Oh. And he said that about two different chicks. There's oh. another one. She looked a little older, but, you know, she was still pretty young. Oh, so he for real, like, into kids. Yeah. 
Like I think he said he got like a six. Like he, he's with like a fifteen year old, sixteen year old. He's with us fifteen. Uh, that's what Ant Man said, but I don't know Ant Man. Like that's something he would do, but that's something Ant Man would lie about. He's eighteen to cover right? up his tracks. If, if he's with a eight, uh, so he's eighteen. If he's with a sixteen year old, that's fine. Fifteen year old, that's crazy. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Hmm. I don't know three age a three year age gap. I, I think I said this before. Mm-hmm. Three age. Three year age gap before the age of twenty one is crazy, and then after you're twenty one, I mean, I guess a three age. Uh, yeah, you could have a fifty year age gap. It's fine. You feel me? Yeah. But like, if you're under twenty one, three age, I think the limit's like two years, under for under twenty one. So in my opinion, what 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 do you think? Yeah, I think two years is really where you cut it. Yeah. Like anything else that you're kind of pushing it, and then over three years is insane. That's crazy to me. Again, only that's if you're too much. If only if you're twenty one plus, then that's fine. I feel like, well, what's three? I don't know, man. Just so like a twenty four and a twenty one year old, that's fine. I don't know. I just know we're not on that. Yeah, you know, what's his name? We're not on that sneaker timing because he wants to lower down the age of consent. I, he doesn't want age of consent. That's <laughs> exactly. What I heard. That's what I'm. He does. He doesn't he want. Says. One. He's like, yo, we should lower down the age of consent. Fucking groomer. You think sne- But sneakers never touch the kid. At least, at least I hope he's not. I don't... Perfect. Yeah, no, no, you're right. You're 100% right. But I, he'd be fine with that. Like, if he sees, like, a 24... Like, a 25-year-old getting with a 16-year-old, he thinks that's fine. Yeah, but, like, Sneakers is retarded, you feel me? Yeah, he is like, retarded. He, he's, just, he's just dumb. That's fine. He's but a I mean, skinhead who could probably take five bullets. Hey, man, if someone's got five bullets... Pull hey, up on Hubert. Pull up on Hubie. Write his name on all five, you feel me, and give him that shit. On <laughs> Hubert. <laughs> No, nah, but also I mean, though, hold up. Uh-huh. Listen, him and Eric have a, a very similar philosophy. Both of their breakfast champions is watching their girls get <laughs> fucked. Remember, Angel? I mean, fuck Angel. <laughs> Sneeko's a huge cuck too. Remember when I used to be on that shit? Not no cuck shit, but like I used to be on some like, oh yo, you know. I mean, I, I'll fuck with a with an open relationship. Remember that shit when I was like like two years ago? I don't remember it that much. But, like, I used to, like, preach about, like, open relationships and shit, right? Probably didn't take you seriously. Yeah, probably. But, like, I was, like, because, like, I wanted to be a slut. Now now it's, like, monogamy is a W, right? But, like, back then, like, I was, like, oh, yeah, I want to fuck, you know, any chick I want but still be in a relationship. But it's, like, and I got that philosophy from bro, right? And, you know, I you know, I thought it was, I thought it was smart. Like, I thought it was, like, um, like a reasonable thing to stand on until I heard about him on some Eric shit. He was in the room watching her get piped. I was like, oh, hell no. Nah. I was like, oh, hell no. Nah. This is just a weirdo. That's why he's behind this shit. This is just odd. Mm-hmm. You feel me? So I was like, nah, 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 nah. I'm not with that shit no more. So yeah, no more open relationships for Chop Sway. Except, well, except if it's like on our part and then she's monogamous to us. But yeah, part, You know what I mean? Like on some hey, You remember, shit. you did also say we were going to populate like a small village of a yeah, thousand Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean Woman. though? Like she, like, like on some shit like, I don't, I don't even know, bro. I don't even know. Mm-hmm. Type shit, bro. I, I am planning on populating a whole small town uh, worth of just my offspring. You feel me? So I'm taking applicants. DM us on Chop Soy Insta. Mm-hmm. Exactly. If anyone wants to be a part of this project, as as you know, what I mean, uh, that's why I'm calling it now. A pro- it's a project. You feel me? It's it's a project, for sure, for sure, for sure. It's not even like, oh, who wants to be my wife? No, it's like who wants to be a part of something that's gonna change history. You feel me? So only woman, only woman though, only woman though, because I don't. Guys can't reproduce, so... I... Yeah. Unless, like... Well, I don't... You ever seen, like, those weird-ass videos where it's, like, a man that's pregnant? I'm like, oh, my God. I don't understand that. I've never looked man. into it. It just... It pisses me off. It, it comes up, and that's that's how I know. I don't know if it's true, though. Has a man ever given a birth? Oh, that's not no. trans, obviously. Like, a biological man. Has a biological man ever given birth? No, because I'm pretty sure even men who are, like, born with, like, estrogen and have, like, fallopian tubes, mm-hmm. they're still considered female, even though they, like, they have body hair. Like, without, like, the doctor having to give them shit to transition. 
Cause, but it's still, it's still considered a female, scientifically. Because I, I, I have seen this one TikTok where, like, this trans dude, he, and he's genuinely pregnant. Like, the dude has a fucking huge stomach, and he's like, oh, I'm, I'm 30 weeks That's pregnant. That's what I'm saying. Isn't that bro's called, like, like... I don't know, but bro's genuinely pregnant. Like, this shit's crazy. And, like, it's, it's real because, like, he has videos up of him with, his, like, his kid type shit that he fucking birthed. I'm like yo, that shit. I don't, I don't know. Mm-mm. I don't, I don't know where to find it. I'll shout bro out whenever I find find him, but I don't know. Is, that, is it a dude? It's a transgender man. I'm, a, I'm assuming he has a vagina because he gave birth to a whole ass kid. So I'm assuming it's he has a vagina, but yeah, because Chopsa came out of her butts. Don't forget. Yeah, we came out. No way. No, we said somebody else came out of our butts. Chopsa. Chops away came out you of her butt. You birthed Chops out of her butt. This shit came said out of assholes. assholes. No, yeah, this shit came out you of her asshole. You made it crazier. Like, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. It did come out of our assholes. Tell you shit. Mm-hmm. Tell you shit. You got any, anything else to add? Any last um, words? Venezuelan chicks. I know your your country's in a turmoil. So come pre on me. Come stay with me. Yeah, pre on him. Anyways, we're out. Bye. It's kind of hot.